Adventures in Pixie Land presents your daily energy reading. Your daily astrology reading for August 10th, 2024 is the waxing crescent moody moon in emotional Scorpio sextile messenger Mercury retrograde in practical Virgo. The information you are seeking requires focused concentration with the bigger picture in mind. It will actually open up new opportunities or possibilities for you. Your Elder Futhark Daily Rune for August 10th, 2024 is Hagalaz. Hagalaz, the letter H, meaning hail or stone. Associations, disruption, wild power, change, disruptive weather, storms, wrath of nature, uncontrolled forces. Today, expect disruptions. It may literally be weather storms, but it can also denote sudden shifts in energy, leaders, or the means or methods by which you accomplish goals. Your Daily Romance Angel Oracle card for August 10th, 2024 is Separation. Separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. The romance angels are helping you during this period of separation from your partner. This card comes as an indication of angelic support as you spend time away from each other. While you're apart, the angels can help you fill your hours with healthy activities, which will help your present or future relationships. This card may indicate a temporary period of aloneness, such as while your partner is traveling for business, or a time in your life when you're single and preparing for your next relationship. It can also mean a marital separation or a divorce. Call upon the angels to, for support and guidance during these transitions. They can help you discover the deep healing that is to be mined as you spend time alone, which prepares you for the next part of your relationship. <laughs> Your Daily Fairy Wisdom Oracle card for August 10th, 2024 is Chocolate Brownie Fairy. Card 62, Chocolate Brownie Fairy. Enjoy, eat more chocolate today. The Chocolate Brownie Fairy is all about the sweetness of life. Allow yourself to fully partake in all of the sweetness that life has to offer. Live in the moment. See the joy in all things, from the tiniest butterfly to the beauty of the highest peaks. Laugh as much as you possibly can, especially if it is about yourself. If you have an opportunity to go on an adventure, have your bags packed, ready and waiting. Meet new people and enjoy interesting things. Learn something new each day. Find fun and adventure even in the simplest things. Make your life a party. Remember to play. And if you have to work, Bring the spirit of play into your workplace. Embrace all of life to the fullest. Rejoice at being on this earth. Be grateful for the experience. And above all else, eat more chocolate. <laughs> Can you enchant? My heart is light and my spirit sings. I worry myself about not one thing. I am happy and willing and ready to go. I jump into the stream of life and just go with the flow. So be it. Your daily Starseed Oracle for August 10, 2024 is the Courageous Peony. The Courageous Peony, multifaceted, unique nature. Let yourself be seen. Flowers don't open and close according to who walks by. 
They embrace all of what they are and show it to the world around them. The peony doesn't try to compete with the cherry blossom, and the cherry blossom doesn't try to compete with the tulip. They own what they are, and they trust the timing of their true nature. You're being called to do the same. It's time to open yourself up to being seen. Time to share your incredible, multifaceted, true nature with the world around you. To uncover and reveal your soul's greatest gifts without wavering. To own your uniqueness without apology. There is a flower on this planet that holds the same qualities that your soul is readying itself to express. Let it inform you. You may have been taught that it's safer to keep your light hidden and your voice small, to hide behind the bushes instead of growing tall. The courageous peony is here to remind you that it is safe to embody all of who you truly are. It is safe to share your voice and let yourself be seen. At first, it may feel uncomfortable. You may be afraid of what others think. But with each passing day, it becomes easier. Little by little, you realize that it draws in those who are meant for you. And experiences you've been longing for arrive at your feet. Your starseed soul inquiry, how are you being called to allow yourself to be more visible and seen in the world? Your daily priestess of the light oracle card for August 10th, 2024 is go with the flow. Card 25, go with the flow, letting go, cleansing, receiving. This priestess of the waterfall rises from the foam, holding the mists of water spirits close to her heart. She wears a golden spiral of infinity on her headdress symbolizing the power of purification and the release of negativity. When this card appears in your spread, it announces a time of quiet energy, encouraging you to release resistance and go with the flow. True release requires a conscious intention to let go of control and embrace the cleansing energy of a non-attachment. It is a time to step back and reevaluate things. Take a break from trying to force your will and open your heart to the guidance of spirit flowing within and around you. This doesn't mean you should take no action. It means your action should flow with your intuition. Water is an important element in your life experience. It brings clarity and understanding and represents the presence of spirit. You are a body of water, as is this blue planet of ours. On that level, you resonate with earth and every entity on it. So charge the water you drink with love and affirm spirit's presence in the rain, in the shower, and in the water all around you. This cleansing intention purifies your energy and releases limitation and negativity. Such a clear and vibrant resonance then opens your life to the unlimited flow of abundance available to you. Let go and receive, for the river of endless opportunity is coming your way. Your affirmation? I move comfortably through the experience of my life. I release resistance and align myself with the joyous energy free flowing through the world. Your daily energy reading for August 10th, 2024 is the astrology is telling you seek and yes, you shall find, but concentration is not included in the package. It's B-Y-O-C. If you want to get ahead, Hagalaz is either weather will be problematic or things will not go as planned. 
the romance oracle wants you to know that uh, you are riding solo dolo today, no matter what the plans were. The fairies remind you to treat yourself with little rewards all day long. The star seed oracle says you don't need to pretend to be something you're not for anyone in the world. It is recommended you remove them from your life, anyone who is trying to use any form of force to get their way from you. The priestess of light oracle reminds you that as long as you care about anything, you will have problems in life. It's called detachment. You have to not care about whether or not your life ever improves because you can't be focused on any place that your life might have lack. And since everything that every, everyone else in the world does affects everything else that everyone else in the world does. As long as you allow any person in your life that speaks to you with any form of disrespect and they have no interest in, you know, correcting themselves, they tell you, when you tell them, you know, something like, you please don't treat me like this. It makes me feel this way. Well, I'm sorry you feel that way. I, red flag on the play. They're not correcting their behavior. They're out. Any language like that, they have to be out. Because if you continue to allow them in your life, they are attached to you. They have attachment to you and their attachment and obsession with you will keep you from achieving anything unless you can find a way to block them on the spiritual plane. Now, I wish I could, I could give you a bunch of different things if you reach out, depending upon which problem you have that I have used. But I can tell you that I've done in some people, I've done repeated combinations of different things. And it's still, even though they're not in my 3D world, hasn't made them go away. So um, you can pray for them and, and hope that works. I mean, I have. So if it, you find a particular prayer that works for you, you go ahead and reach out and tell me what it is. Because uh, I would be willing to try it. But absolutely, if they don't care about your feelings, they hear your feelings and they're, they're not being respectful back. They're saying, I hear your feelings, but I don't care about your feelings. So they have no place. If they don't show you respect off the get, then they should have no place in your life because you can't fix someone ever. You can only work on you and how you respond to anyone else. So you can never make them treat you better. There's no amount of love you can pour into them that will make them treat you better. How they treat you is how they feel about you. It doesn't matter what words they say. If their words and actions aren't in alignment, they're not trustworthy and they can't stay in your world. If you choose to live them, leave them in your world, you choose to take on all of their life's problems and solve them with them and for them. Likely for them, because if they're treating you with disrespect, they likely are not trying to solve their own problems. So plan accordingly.